Once upon a time in the kingdom of Denmark, there lived a young prince named Hamlet. He was a thoughtful and introspective young man who often pondered the complexities of life and death. His father, King Hamlet, had recently died under mysterious circumstances, and his mother, Queen Gertrude, had quickly married his uncle, Claudius, who now sat upon the throne. Hamlet was troubled by his father's death and the hasty marriage, suspecting foul play. One night, as he walked the battlements of Elsinore Castle, he encountered the ghost of his father. The ghost revealed a shocking truth. He had been murdered by Claudius to seize the throne. The spirit urged Hamlet to avenge his death. Haunted by this revelation, Hamlet decided to feign madness to uncover the truth behind his father's murder. He put on a facade of erratic behaviour and wild speech which puzzled and concerned the royal court. His antics drew the attention of his childhood friends, Rosencrantz and Guildenstern, who had been sent by Gludius to spy on him. As Hamlet delved deeper into his investigation, he devised a plan to expose Claudius's guilt. He commissioned a group of actors to perform a play within the play, reenacting the alleged murder of King Hamlet. During the performance, Claudius's reaction confirmed his guilt, and Hamlet knew he must take action. However, the path of revenge was not without its toll. Hamlet's madness began to consume him, causing turmoil within himself and among his loved ones. Ophelia, the daughter of Polonius and Hamlet's love interest, went mad and died. Her brother, Laertes, returned to seek vengeance for her death, further complicating the situation. The climax of the story unfolded in a duel between Hamlet and Laertes. Claudius, aware of Hamlet's knowledge and the danger he posed, conspired with Laertes to poison Hamlet's sword and a goblet of wine. In the duel, the poison blade wounded Hamlet, and Laertes was also fatally wounded. As Hamlet lay dying, he managed to wound Claudius with the poison sword and forced him to drink from the poison goblet. With his last breath, Hamlet finally avenged his father's murder. The kingdom of Denmark was left in turmoil, with a trail of death and destruction in the wake of Hamlet's quest for justice. The tragedy of Hamlet, Prince of Denmark, is a timeless tale of revenge, madness, and the moral complexities of taking matters into one's own hands. Hamlet's journey serves as a cautionary tale about the consequences of unchecked ambition and the toll that seeking vengeance can exact on a person's soul.